disc two. Two discs with one disc to go? I don't know. Uh, I want that one. The golden butterfly! Ah! I bet there's rape in this. There's another woman in a parking lot on her own. No one fucking learns in this game. Oh, this man's walking at her quickly. Oh. Oh, shit. Galloway. My drunken friend. Got it, Skipper. Yeah, I'll bring him. He's my partner. Don't sound so upset. What we got? New case. White female dumped in plain sight in the grass at the end of Hill Street. Hacks are all over it. Captain's trying to fend them off. Oh dear. That sounds awfully similar. The first rule of police work is make no assumptions until you've seen the evidence. Skipper wants you to have your newspaper face on, college boy. I think I know the place where they found the lady. It oh overlooked gosh. Sunset Boulevard. Let's go. Yeah, I'm thinking. <sighs> Still as talkative as ever, I see. He wants a five star uh, goddamn wet. Is this our car? No? Oh, okay. Oh, God, I've got to remember how to drive again. Oh, bloody hell. Did a decent job of the head of the case, fell. Not bad for your first time in the back. Thanks, Rusty. Don't go getting ahead of yourself. That's one clearance under Ooh. your belt. Now it's a new day with a new dead lady that needs our attention. No assumptions until we see the evidence, right? Right. See, I knew you were a fast learner, Phelps. Uh, where are we going? Oh, Jesus. Uh, this may cause... Oh, no. Uh, ooh. Oh shit. Oh no, not up there. Oh bloody hell. How do I get there again? We had this last time. Uh, can I go? Oh, no, okay. Um, so she's like... Oh, she's up above us, okay. That's a bit awkward. I'm back near the police station. Excuse me. Um. I'm very sorry about your car. Oh, this fucking place again. Uh, going down the little drive. Is that, is that a police officer or just a random... No, it's a random man with a very nice hat. Oh, here. Now, boys, boys, you know as much as I do. I'll be holding a press conference once the autopsy's been completed. Nicely done. I have two of my finest investigators on the case. Fresh from bringing down the sword of justice on the crazed sex... Captain, aren't Lewis. there similarities between this murder and the murder of Celine Henry? And of Elizabeth Short, for that matter. So you matter. don't believe there's a crazed sex killer at large boys, preying on women? Boys, be sensible. We have the greatest police force... <laughs> Random people the walking through the crime scene. scientific investigators are our disposal. How can any killer continue to be that? Be advised. We keep the gas chamber at San Quentin primed for the sons of Cain who continue to believe they can take a life in the city of Angels. Yeah, right. Any new leads in the Dahlia case? Oh, you're just a little Run troll, on, aren't boys, you? And Piss off. Get to work. We have God's work to do here and it can't be delayed. What do we have, Captain? Another woman sacrificed. Oh, Speak dear. to Carruthers. I want daily reports, gentlemen. 
I bet she's naked. That's the car. Seems like a decent guy. Why are you all here? I was first on scene. Oh, hello, Carruthers. Carruthers, you hello. Not me. Oh no, Gonzalez. Me out for a stroll. I was first reporting. And you oh, show dear. me the body. It's under the pepper tree. This way. The wash tree. The pepper tree. Oh dear. Oh oh dear. Can't be much help to you, uh, Alps. What are you doing on the crime scene? Piss off. Oh dear. Here she is. Oh dear. <laughs> okay. Censorship time. Uh, what is this here? I've just trodden on. Ah, size eight feet, perhaps? The stomping angle in the Henry case. Was it reported in the press? Sure was. Every detail a copycat would want was there in the story. Oh, shit. Who's walking across the fucking crime scene? Oh, that's gross. Oh, God, has he stopped? Oh. Okay, what else have we got? Oh, we've got the uh, the purse again. So what's that? Oh well, we dear. Can you run Deirdre Muller by R and I? Back in a second. Oh dear. What else have we got in there? Is that just money? If the motive was robbery. Why not take the money? Because it's not rob it's not robbery, is it? It's like weird. Perverted rape killings. Here we go. Does he have to straddle her? Oh, that's a stra That's a strangling. Your mark is very distinctive. Mm. I'll do some comparisons back at the lab and get back to you. Stomping. Can I not look into it any further? It's got a bit weird with the sunlight, but okay. No? Oh! Oh! Looks like she was tied up. It does at first, but that would leave a mark on her other wrist, too. I think her watch might have been okay. torn off. Okay, so he takes jewellery from women as trophies. Serial killer Duda. Um, what is that? Oh, That's the ring smart. again. A cut on the finger. Fourth finger, left hand. A wedding or engagement ring. Violently removed. Okay. The Deidre Mahler of 130 North Bonnie Bray was reported missing this morning by her husband, Hugo Mahler. What I tell you? Ah. Oh. Just grab the husband, take him downtown, and work him over. You can have this wrapped up by lunchtime. What about not making assumptions and going on the evidence? Hmm. Similar remote. The what? The Dahlia? The Dahlia. I don't think so. Celine Henry. That's a closed case. This is probably another sad sack who lost his temper with a broad who wouldn't put out. Are you a suspect, Rusty? Watch your mouth, though. You're a little shit. All I'm saying is we got enough to do without reopening closed cases. Talk me through it, Mal. Severely battered, on display. Footprints would indicate that she has been stomped. Size of the footprints would seem to indicate a smallish men's shoe. Yeah. What size shoe did Mendez wear? Size eight. You finished? No, I'm not. At a glance, I would say strangulation was the cause of death. I need to do further tests for semen. Angry boyfriend. They were married. You're a pain in the home. ass. Get out. Helping out here in Lover's Lane. Okay, we're done. Let's go. Can I bolt this? The daily workout. There we go. <laughs> Damn straight it is. And I'm taking this car. I don't care what you say. It's blue. It's nice. This is KGI, a member of the American Okay. Ooh, lovely. Lovely music. 
like how everyone's running as soon as I start driving. Oh, I don't have a siren, do I? Oh, sugar. Um, sorry. It's not like I. Oh, I can. I thought we were on our way to lock up the husband. If it doesn't work out, then. Deirdre Muller has suffered enough. More than enough. You shouldn't make disparaging comments about her without even the slightest inkling of what she was like. She was a woman, wasn't she? You're a fag, honey. Divorce, I realized women might not be the pure angels we imagine. You're married, ain't you, Phelps? Don't make any insinuations about my wife. Hey, she's a woman. She's the mother of my children. <laughs> I have children? But don't tell me your eye don't bend. This conversation is over. Wow. Oh, no, no, no. Oh. Oh, damn it. I'm not doing well. Where am I going? Oh, screw it. We're going on the pavement. It's probably safer than actually... Ooh. left at the next intersection. Okay. Oh, um, that wasn't really left, we was it? we survive this, it's gonna be a miracle. Oh, shit. Uh, you'll survive it, just not in one piece. I'm not sure why I'm going around this way, but it appears to work better. Making a right at the next intersection. Okay. I need you to take a left at the next corner. Shite. Give me a break. Yeah. Deal with it. Oh Christ. Oh Christ. Oh God, get out of the way. Ah. Jesus, Phelps! I know what I'm doing. <laughs> I really don't. You're gonna kill someone. Yes, yes I am. Oh, shite. No, don't turn. Side quickly. Thank you. Oh, I, I probably want this turn. Ooh. There we go. Belmont Avenue. Turn back. We're going the wrong way. What? Oh shit! Go left now. Can you hurry up, please? Also, why have you got an umbrella? It's really sunny. God's sake. Up ahead, you make a right. right. Oh. You're making a right. And making a right. This isn't really an intersection. Oh, maybe he means this. Oh, he does. Okay, let's just pull up here. There we go. This looks okay. There's nothing like unusual about it, although I'm going to check out that fire at the back because it might be worth it. Burning evidence? No? Okay. 
Da 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 da. Oh no, that's not the right newspaper. Da da da. Some clothes. Okay, let's go around the front again. <sighs> Phelps and Galloway, LAPD. Is your father home? He'll be home soon. He's been out looking for mommy. Uh -oh. What's your name, miss? Michelle Eloise Mahler. Can we come in? I oh, no. So. No, you don't let Thank in the random strangers. That door's missing. Me, oh no, it's there. It's just changed colour. Don't light up. Don't light up at someone's house. That's really rude. He'll be back in a moment. Just sit tight. God. That's really, really rude. You're in someone else's house, man. Oh. Oh. Optimistic call. Don't forget Mum's birthday. Some nice little... What was that? Hexagonal cakes there. Good job on the faces, Eleanor. I'll show you about the cakes. A glass. I don't want that. Uh, is that more hexagonal cakes? Yeah, those are supposed to be cookies, I think. Uh, what am I picking up here? A lemon? Nothing significant. So, a carrot? It doesn't appear to be connected. Why on earth can I pick these things up, but not the knife? Oh. No, okay, nothing else. That's interactive. Uh, anything here? No, I'd already checked. What's the end of the hall? No. There's some shoes I think I just saw there. Oh! Oh! Elgin ah! Watch. Probably the same one snatched from her body. So an expensive one. And then this will be the ring. No sign of a wedding ring. That's it, okay. Anything around here? A really weird painting there. Some boots. Oh. Work boots. Size eight. Oh dear. There's nothing on the bottom other than a bit of mud. Hmm. I think this is a bit of a conspiracy. What have you got in here? Have you got anything in here? No. The music stopped, hasn't it, as well? Mm-hmm. Okay, small child. Talk to me. Is this about mommy? Daddy is trying to find her. Please tell me she's okay. She's not. I'm sorry to have to tell you this, Michelle, but your mother is dead. <laughs> Do you think you could answer a few questions for us? Could try. Good girl. When did you last see your mother? Yesterday afternoon. Okay. I went to a dance at Belmont High. Mommy was supposed to pick me up, but she didn't show. So what did you do then? Oh. I was upset. Daddy came instead. Ooh. Very deadpan. Although looking away, um, hmm. Oh, you piece of shit.
Oh, sod it. Let's see if she tells the truth. And did he come and get you? Of course. Some boys offered me a ride home, but that's not the right thing to do. Good girl. So you were hanging around the school for quite a while. What happened with your father? I don't know. I called and called and finally he answered. He came straight away then. Mm. Oh shit, so I did do that wrong. Some of your mother's jewelry was missing. Can you describe her things? A ring, a watch. I never paid much attention to that stuff. Okay, so we know from the previous one that that face is, um... You seem reluctant to talk about her jewelry. It's a touchy subject with Daddy. Oh, is it now? He thought she wasted too much money on her appearance. What? What? How am I Your so mom bad and dad at this? Are, uh, happily married? What are you saying? Of course they are. Of course she'd say that. Oh. Ho, ho, ho. What have I got in the notebook? Mm. They weren't happy, were they, Michelle? Did your father ever hit your mother? Just the once. <sighs> Just that she would leave him if he ever did it again. He bought her a brooch pin to make up for it. Mm -hmm. He always wore her golden butterfly. For what? I know this is a tough time for you, Michelle, but you should really try and help the police. Him from Heroes. Here. I'll talk to the police. How do you pull me as Go to your room, young lady. Who instantly also does the voice and condemns the thing? Can't come in here interrogating her like she's some kind of. Your wife was found murdered this morning. Found? What? The... But but she only. Oh dear. We have some questions that we would like to ask you. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. I'll do my best. Okay. What size shoe do you wear, Mr. Muller? Why do you ask? It's routine, sir. Please Simple say a ten, of so I can just go. You're lying. Nines, I think. Oh, you're lying! I actually know you're Why lying. Why are you lying to me, Mr. Muller? Why would I lie to you at a time like this? Because you're a twat and you have size eight work boots in your bedroom. That's funny. Own. The work boots we found here are size eights. Why lie about it if you've got nothing to hide? Because I always get teased about the size of my feet. <laughs> you know, small feet, small... Brains. Always been true in my experience. Got a question right, I got a question right. So you were here all night. You stayed in while your wife went out to pick up your daughter? Yes, that's correct. Uh... You're lying again. You should come clean if you're having an affair or if there's something going on. I told you I was here. Were you saying I wasn't? Yeah, I am saying you weren't. So why did you take so long to answer Smack the phone when down. you got Okay, I went out for a while. I was I was driving around. It's my way of relaxing. Uh-huh. You phoned in a missing persons report this morning? Yeah, that's right. Uh, my wife didn't come home last night. She left around... She left around 9.30. Uh, Michelle was out at dance. She called me to let me know that Deidre didn't turn up. Mm-hmm. You're looking very antsy. But I don't know what... Oh, sod it. Okay. Did your wife ever go out by herself to bars, nightclubs? No. Oh. What are you, what are you suggesting? Are you suggesting my wife's loose? No. 
Now is not the time for you to be pushing. I think I failed that one. Your daughter said you were having an argument. We argued about who would pick up Michelle. I worked a full day. I yeah, that's to right. You sit down. Oh, I, I, I passed. Your wife went to pick up Michelle. Yes. Mm-hmm. That's right. Your oh, I don't know. You are so dodgy. It's unbelievable. What have we got in here? Just, just general. Okay. Now. What happened, Hugo? You got any theories? Because we're starting to like you for this. The car park by the school is kind of dark. Uh, uh -huh. maybe somebody jumped in there. Did you try the parking lot? Oh, shit. Maybe you was telling the truth Your wife then. was beaten and then strangled. In your case, you have no alibi and a history of violence towards your wife. That's not, that's not true, God damn it. Uh, yeah, it is. It is true, Hugo. You're a violent man. You try to keep a lid on it at home, but sometimes you lost control. Your daughter and your wife were scared of you. You don't know anything about me. Oh, look. Butterfly brush. I know about the golden butterfly, Hugo, and how you bought your wife off the last time you heard her. She liked to spend money, all right? Dresses, uh, mm -hmm. jewelry, her hair. It drove me goddamn crazy. Do I look like a Rockefeller? Nobody likes a cheapskate, Hugo. Getting hostile with us Four is a very five. bad idea, Hugo. I'm no murderer. Make some arrangements for your daughter and then present yourself ding, to ding, Central ding, Station. Ding, 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 ding. Oh, no. 